hello everyone welcome back so next um, we will see a lesson to selecting sorting and measuring object so in this lesson we will learn how to manipulate the object in the pipeline using command that sort select and measure the object so selecting sorting and measuring object is essential to successfully creating automation in the windows powershell so in this lesson we will uh, sort the object using sort dash object command and uh, measure object using measure dash object command and similarly for select object will be using select dash object command so first sorting object by a property so by default each command will have their own default sort order so uh, we can use sort dash object to resort object in the pipeline so for example get dash service by default uh, display the output in ascending order so we can use the sort command to resort the uh, you know the name using the name parameter to uh, you know to descending the order we can specify this parameter and we can also uh, you know group the output using the group by parameter and group object command okay so some windows partial command so that produce their output in a specific order for example uh, get dash process and uh, get dash service if you look at this so uh, there are three properties status name display name and it uh, display the output in a ascending order with the name so by default this sort in ascending order this command which is get dash service but some command that would display in a different way for example get dash event log so this would display the output i want to get the system event log so this would be display the output or sort the output with the time so in other cases the output may not appear to be sorted at all so sometime we may want to you know specifically use some sort order to be able to uh, sort it differently so we can also use the uh, sort we can use the sort dash uh, object or as an alias sort so we can use a uh, sort dash object or sort that is then alias so sort dash object um, so this command accept one or more property name to sort by and by default this would sort an ascending order and we can specify the descending parameter to you know get the output in a descending format and if you want to specify more than one property for example uh, status name then the first sort by default and then the second one would be sorted so in this case it will sort the status and uh, then it will sort by the name and it is not possible in a single command to sort one property in ascending and another one in a descending order 
so in this example get dash service we can use sort dash object we can also use the alias just short and also we can uh, by default it will be displayed in ascending order so if we wanted to get that in a descending format we can choose the uh, property name and specify the descending parameter so in a short we can also mention this so we can also sort it using more than one property status and name let's see that example here get dash service so we can use sort dash object So with the property name, I'm going to descending the output. So if you look at the uh, name property, so it just uh, sorting in a descending order. So similarly, we can also use the get service, just then alias, sort and this. If I bit to more, then you will get the same output. And we can also sort it using multiple property status name. So here, if you look at the status parameter, first it sort by stop and the name in a ascending format and next it display the running process state okay next a grouping object by property so in the sorting object uh, by default format list format table and format white so these command light will allow the group by parameter and uh, we can you know use this group by for all these uh, options so we can uh, just group by the property name so for example um, get dash service and sort the object with the status and name property and we will be grouping it in a format wide fw and uh, using the status we will group the object so get dash service so i'm going to use the sort with the property status name and uh, with the format wide format I'll be grouped by status so if I pipe to more first it will group all the uh, status showing stopped so all the stopped process and then it will you know group all the process which is running So this is all about sorting the object and uh, next we will see measuring object.